Hey, what's up everybody? It's your boy D. Welcome to another episode. Now, every episode is like a brick that I lay down for my foundations. Success is not overnight, but a video like could change my life. So if you would consider hit that like button and subscribe to my channel so you can follow my journeys on conquering this dream of mine. Okay, let's get started. So it's been about two weeks since I last upload a videos on my YouTube channels and there are a lot of changes in my life that I wanted to share with you guys. So it's about seven o'clock in Vietnam right now. I'm about to go get some breakfast so I get the energy so I can tell you all about it. So at the breakfast, I am currently at my dad's house right now. You know, I'm so excited today because I just complete three websites for three different clients. That's one of the biggest reasons why I have an upload video consistently on my YouTube channels because I have to do website design for my clients. You know, doing videos on a daily basis is already a challenge. Doing videos and website design for clients is a big challenge for me. That's why I wanted to expand my team right now. But first, let's go make some coffee, huh? The reason why I want to take you to this place right here behind me is my family land. If you have been following my channels, you probably know in the last few videos I shared with you guys about this land right here and how my family was selling it. But now we are no longer selling it. We are planning to uh, develop this land right here. So let's uh, open this gate and go inside so I can show you more. All right, you guys, so we are currently in my family land right now. So we are planning to develop this land right here so that we'll have the uh, coffee shop over here. We have the uh, fishing pond over here. So that one over there is going to be a garden where you can plant fruit and vegetables. And as you can see, like throughout the whole piece of land, we have a lot of uh, fruit and vegetable plants already. And uh, let me show you, there are a lot of fish in the pond already. All right, you guys, let me uh, show you uh, something real cool. Have you seen a chicken hatching some ducks? It's real, you guys. 
Just kidding. The duck's mom is over there. So the chicken is just babysitting right now. You know, my job as a website designer, I very much enjoy uh, doing some work at the uh, coffee shop. So I think building the uh, coffee shop right here will be very benefit for the long term. I'm so excited you guys because this land right here is going to be a coffee shop. That piece of land over there is going to be a hotel where people can stay overnight with us. So we have the coffee shop over here, we have the hotel over there. This one over here is going to be a garden and maybe in the future, you know that corner over there, I will create an office over there. Somewhere in this area over here, or maybe it could be over here where it's going to be an outdoor workout place. So it's going to be very excited. I can't wait for you guys to join me on this journey of developing this piece of land right here. So right now we just have a lot of fruit and vegetable. And you can see these vegetables over here are eatable. You know, you can steam these and you can eat them. And over here, it's just some, uh, some herbal vegetables over here smell very good and we have some fruit over here and it's just blooming right now and you can see the fruit over here you can eat this one right here it's very sour but it's good okay let's see if this is sour mm. oh man oh very sour okay we have some uh, string beans over here and this is the uh, purple string beans, as you can see. It's very good and it's ready, you know. Sometimes when we want to make soup, we just uh, cut them off and uh, go home, wash them and cook them. Or sometimes if we want to uh, saute them, we can do it. And we have some uh, vegetables over here. Do you know what this is called? It's not eggplant. Um, I forgot, I'll put it in the videos later. And over here we have the uh, mango tree. We have some uh, papaya over here. Okay, some more string beans. And there are a lot of coconuts over there. And over here we have some uh, sugar cane. Okay. So for the next two to five years, I'm planning to stay over here. And uh, all of the money I make will be invested into uh, this piece of land right here where I can build the coffee shop over there. I can build an office over here and I can do all of the uh, creative work either in the office or in the uh, coffee shop and we are planning to do a lot of fun activities for this land right here so if you ever visit Vietnam and you need a place to stay maybe you can uh, come over here and visit me you can go over here and you know have some coffee and you can stay overnight over here Maybe we'll have some uh, bicycles, some electric bikes, where you can, uh, you know, travel around the locals. You can explore this piece of land right here. This land right here is very peaceful. There's not a lot of dust, not a lot of pollution. The air is very fresh, not a lot of dust, not a lot of noise. So it's a good place for you to, you know, stay and do your creative work over here. All right, so I think I'm gonna head back to my dad's house and finish the coffee. All right, you guys, so if you're interested in this project, please hit that subscribe button so you can follow more contents like this. And it would be amazing if you can hit that like button also. Thank you so much. All right, you guys, so I am currently at my mom's house right now. And I was thinking of going to the uh, coffee shop, but look at the clouds. It looks like it's about to rain. It's been raining like crazy over here, but uh, I'm still debating whether if I should go to the uh, coffee shop or stay home and do all the work. 
but staying home as you can see like you can hear off the loud music that they're playing the neighbor is not very uh, quiet uh, in this area that's uh, one of the reasons why like I'm really excited to build the uh, coffee shop the office uh, somewhere far somewhere quiet so I, so I can focus on building the uh, business and doing all the uh, creative works it looks like it's about to rain like 80% it's going to rain it's not that I'm afraid uh, my equipment of the cameras of the uh, laptop is going to uh, get wet because I have this uh, camera bag right here let me show you alright so this is my camera bag right here this is from the uh, low pro this is the uh, 350 uh, AWL or something uh, I forget the model but I'll put the link of this uh, camera back in the video description so you can uh, check it out but this bag right here is very cool I think it's uh, waterproof and it comes with this um, this um, covers the uh, water's uh, cover so uh, whenever there's a uh, big rain I will put this thing over the whole back so that all of the equipment in the back is protect and uh, this is the uh, camera back but uh, let's take a look over here like, I have enough space to put the uh, 16 inch laptop in here and I have the uh, Surface Pro and it fit very nicely in here also uh, this is uh, my favorite tablet right here I can do a lot of works on this portable computer okay so that's that but I think I'm gonna go to the uh, coffee shop so I can uh, do some works you know this bag right here has a lot of space and I have the uh, Joby Gorilla 3K right here for my camera so when I go outside I can use this as a tripod and over here is my compartment for the uh, camera Okay, so this is how I would normally open it. Okay, so the camera live right here. And down here I have this uh, compartment where I can do all the uh, chargers, all the stuff, important stuff. I can put it in here. This bag right here has a lot of uh, different place for you to uh, put stuff in here, you know. And right here I can uh, even put a drone in here. But because Vietnam doesn't really allow people to uh, fly drone. I mean, they do allow, but you have to ask permission every time you're going to uh, take flight. So it's uh, really a really big hassle. Okay, so this bag right here has this uh, thing. Okay, the handle. So it's, you can handle it like this, or you can handle it just like this. Okay, so it's very cool. And I put all the uh, chargers and stuff right here. Sometimes my. Uh, my sweaters, my jacket, I can put it in right here. The one thing that I don't really like about this bag is that it's not very comfortable compared to like a North Face uh, backpack. But it's okay, you know, and it's kind of heavy alone by itself because of like all the uh, materials. See, as you can see, this material is very high quality. It's okay, you know, it's not very discomfortable, but it's not as comfortable as the North Face. Okay, so this is not how I usually travel to the uh, coffee shop, but because today I have the camera, because I have the uh, tablet, so I just want to secure everything in this bag right here. Plus, it looks like it's about to rain, so this is how I would travel to the coffee shop in Vietnam. Let's go. Are you guys, so this is the office for the day. We just arrived to the uh, coffee shop. As you can see, so this coffee shop has a really nice environment and it has nice tables good drinks and you can see this drink right here it's just one dollar it comes with the cold iced tea so it's very nice so this is the uh, business model that we wanted to do 
and right now I'm just doing the uh, video editing on the uh, Surface Pro 8. This is Adobe Premiere, so this uh, tablet right here is very powerful. It can handle editing videos on this machine right here. And uh, like I said earlier, it was about to rain. And uh, it did rain, but the uh, backpack hold up pretty well, you know, because of uh, the uh, lining right here. It's kind of uh, waterproofing a little bit. So, okay, that's that. I'm about to uh, put in some work right now, and then uh, maybe later in the evening, I can show you a little bit around. We are currently in town right now, and I have this really nice spot I want to uh, share with you guys, so uh, stay tuned. All right, you guys, so usually after the uh, coffee shop, I would usually go to the uh, park nearby so I can do some stretching, do a light workout because my job, I sit a lot. So it's always good to go over here, do some stress, a little bit workout, and then maybe later when I get tired, I can go uh, get some food. I know this place, they have really good food for a really good price. So I'll uh, show you guys in a little bit, but first let's do a small workout. Alright you guys, check out this scenery right here, it's a very nice sunset right now. Vietnamese food. These are like the um, dollar menu. So um, as you can see like this one right here, I think it's only a 5,000 dong. So about four of these will be uh, a dollar. And uh, this one right here is uh, it's very uh, affordable, it's very nice. And uh, we have more food coming. So I was about to do my little food review show, but then my phone is out of storage and my camera is die, so I couldn't do it. But maybe in the next few videos, I can share you more of the Vietnamese cuisines and all of these affordable places that you can get healthy food. So all of the videos effect that you see throughout my videos, you can find them at smartandgood.com slash creative. I want to thank you so much for watching and please hit that like button and subscribe to follow my channel. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.